Uh, Will Greer reminded me that Trey Lance got traded last week. We hadn't even touched on that. So if you want yeah. to take a few minutes on Trey Lance. And, what did you think about Trey Lance? Uh, Other than you were the right. Trade, the trade surprised me. Like, I even did a... The, yeah, the know, Cowboys. Yeah. I had a story from SI. They told me to, to do six teams. I didn't even have the Cowboys in there. Uh, and, yeah, like, part of me feels like... So when I said, I'll just keep, keep it that way. Jerry Jones not giving Mike McCarthy or Dak Prescott a heads up. They're going to pretend to be some type of way. Like, oh, it's just uh, don't worry about it. They are preparing to maybe not pay Dak Prescott because he doesn't have any more guaranteed money next year. So he's due for an extension. And then he has a massive cap hit of $59 million. That is a Jones family. You know, I don't know if the, the old guy still got it, but he's thinking ahead. Uh, he's Jerry had it Jones. before. Uh, what was that? He's had it before. With what? You said I don't know if the old man <laughs> well, got it. I'm yeah, asking. I guess you back off of Jimmy Johnson in the '90s, so I don't know if he ever had it. You're probably right for now. A good joke. Maybe his son Stephen Jones knows what he's doing, and they got to pay C.D. Lamb. They got to pay Michael Parsons. They just what? paid Trevon Diggs. What? So you're gonna spend more money on Dak Prescott. Maybe you have something in Trey Lance there, and he's thinking ahead. And I kind of like it in case Trey Lance becomes a guy. And if you see Dak Prescott flame out one more time in the playoffs, like that, you can't give any more chances to this guy, right? No. All right. or, or do you think I'm overthinking it? Maybe Trey Lance is just a QB too. But tell me after this clip. Yeah, yeah. Well, this is uh, da- what Dak. Bre- 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 this is what Dak Prescott <laughs> had to say after. Uh, yeah, I was gonna say Dakota Prescott. Well, that's his name actually. Uh, this is what Dak Prescott had to say after finding out about the Trey Lance trade. I mean, I, I can't say that I necessarily expected it. No. Um, I understand that that's business. I understand that they're probably on a timeline. They need to get some done and. As I said, he felt like that strength on this team. To be honest with you, I'm not surprised by anything anymore. Uh, you've been in this league eight years, been on this team. Uh, it's hard to say that I was surprised, to be honest with you. It's funny because I think Jerry – I don't think you're overthinking it, but I think Jerry Jones treat the, treats these his quarterbacks like sons in a sense. So when something happens, they're like, oh, wow, like I thought we were close. You forget to separate owner yeah. and general manager and friend. And I think the players sometimes fall for it. And like, remember with Tony Romo, when they told, when they said, oh, Dak Prescott starting, Tony Romo was like, whoa, like, okay. I know he was injured and everything, but Tony Romo, same things now happening to Dak where they don't believe in Dak. And they're kind of like, oh, wow. Okay. So he's going to try and see what Trey Lance has. Um, I wonder if he's kind of trying to prepare for life after Mike McCarthy too. Like, well, that too, yeah. Because if, if Mike McCarthy didn't even get a heads up either, that's a bad look. That's really bad. I mean, you know, when you hear players say, "Oh, I found out on Twitter about this or that," you're like, "Oh, wow, that's bad." Your head coach who's an offensive play caller doesn't know you're going to bring in a high profile quarterback. So, what, what do you want to bet right now? Do you think they make Trey Lance? Uh, what's it called? Like uh, the dude from the Saints, um, Hill. Taysom Hill. Do yeah. you think they may, they try and make Trey Lance as a Taysom Hill here? They could, but that just really makes it complicated. And then, you know, Mike McCarthy is so Stone Age. Like, you don't want him to mess up his Dallas West Coast offense, you know? So, I don't know. So bad. So bad. If I'm CeeDee Lamb, I'm like, why would I want to stay here? Like, why do I want to sign an extension? It's kind of like the 49ers blueprint. You play, you, you pay your playmakers and you have your quarterback on a cheap yeah. deal. So. Well, and, and the thing is, too, I mean, playing for the Cowboys, regardless of who you are, that pays a lot of money and endorsements. So I, I'm sure that's why. Yeah. Whatever Jefferson gets when he breaks the bank soon, that's another guy who needs to yeah. get paid. CeeDee Lamb will probably be right under that. Exactly. No, I come. And then Jamar Chase is after that. So it's a revolving door.